this uh, Jason. Uh, today I'd like to show you guys some tips about to use Visual Studio 2017 and the setup um, way is the same as 2015 but the 2017 is more strong to support to Python. You don't need to install too many stuff. Just you can it's default default can support Python, C sharp, Visual Basic and more. Okay, then let's start it. Uh, let's start it with just the 2017 and now I open. Uh, okay, the first thing I'd like to share is this one the toolbox, toolbar, toolbar here. They sometimes they disappear and uh, very hard to find it back. So now I only I make a little bit study and find out what's going on there. Okay, so for example, uh, for some reason they always disappear. So you disappear and you want to get it back, that toolbar, you want to get it back. Okay, so right, uh, right click here in this area and uh, in the top area. Okay, and here you select a text editor, then you get this one, these those things back. Okay, and this is very useful because uh, we always, sometimes we need to come in among the, pro the program, right, the statement. Okay, so this first thing we like to, sh I like to share with everybody. And the second thing is the uh, day out. The layout, uh, say for example, I mix up the layout, okay, and disappear, whatever I mix up, make totally uh, messy here um, for some reason. And now what happened? What, ha what should I do? So very easy, okay? So because I, when I first thing going to uh, Visual Studio, you should set up the layout first and save it and next time you, you mix up something you can get it back okay now reset apply window layout okay this layout is I, I saved before okay right away so, so next time when you, you first time you want to use a visual studio you, can, you have to do this okay save windows layout and give your name and in case it makes up a layout, then you can very easily get it back, okay? Uh, the third thing I'd like to share is a line number. Line number is very important. Sometimes if you come in first time, you go into Visual Studio, you won't see the line number. So I show how to get it, get it, get a line number there, okay? So go to Tour and go to Option and uh, Here has one text editor, and uh, depend which one you using. For example, I using Python right now. Okay, Python. Okay, nine numbers are here. Now I already click. If you unclick, this nine number disappear. If you don't find this one, you you won't get a number back. You have to click here. Okay. So just three things I share with uh, everybody right now. And we just did it right now. They support uh, Python and very powerful. Okay, just do a small demo. We just save uh, the program. Okay, and just right click and run start without debugging. All you want to run with debugging is okay, but right now just run without debugging. Okay, and now we get a result. Okay, and show you a little bit here. So okay, we can zoom in, zoom out. Okay, so yeah, okay, thank you for watching. And uh, if you like it, my video, please subscribe. Thank you for your watching. Thank you.